Hi hey everybody, this is Eli Camp here with a quick video on how to create repeating fields within a Microsoft Word document. I have been trying to figure this out for a number of years. I've looked at hundreds of different web pages on how to figure this out. I've even gone and checked through all of the Microsoft Word help documents. About 15 years ago, someone gave me a document I had paid them to create. It was a work agreement that I needed to use in one of my businesses. And in there, we would have the name of the person we were hiring, and it would appear 15 or 20 times through the document. And it's time consuming to go through a document, make sure you've got every instance of where something is so that you can change it. And I knew there was a better way. And so I got this document, it was great. And then when I tried to recreate it for another project, I couldn't figure out how they had done it. And so I ended up just copying that document over and over and over again in order to have this function in my document. So my awesome webmaster, I talked to him yesterday and I was like, dude, do you know how to do this? And he said, no, but I can, I'll find out for you. And he did and he showed me this morning. So I'm gonna show you. <clears throat> so, um, we're first going to say what it is we're doing, so how to create a document with repeating fields. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to have something that's called something specific, and I'm going to build it as a field. So first you come to insert, then you come to quick parts a document property, and you can take the first one on the list. And then we're going to actually call it something specific that should repeat in the text somewhere. And while I'm on it, while I'm clicked, you can see this word abstract shows up here, which is what I picked off of the quick parts list, but I want that to be something different. So I'm gonna to come to the developer tab and if you do not have developer on your Microsoft menu bar, just search Google for adding the developer option to the Microsoft Word menu. And there are hundreds of people who have described how to do this. It's very simple. If you have it, then you just can move on. So developer properties. And now you wanna do three things in here. I'm gonna give it a title. The tag is the same as the title. And then I'm going to check this box down here in case you have multiple sentences or paragraphs that need to automatically change in a document. And then I click OK. Now that I've done that, I'm going to click on the little gray tab here and I'm going to right click and copy. You can also use Control C. And we'll go here to this place where it's another instance of where we want the thing to show up and we're going to paste it. Okay, so now we have these two fields, one there and one here. Watch what happens when I change this to something else. A thing that is named, that is called purple pigment, period. So I've changed it. Now watch down here when I click out of it, purple eggplant. And voila, that's how you do it. And I hope that that helps somebody out there because it really makes my life a lot easier. Have a great day.